Hey guys, what's up? PC Cool Kid here, and I'm back to making some videos. And today I'm just going to show you a simple client that you can use, you know, for IMing, email, whatever, and it's called Digsby. And uh, it's really useful. It's, um, it's pretty cool. It's a very nifty thing to have. Um, you can use it, uh, yeah, as I said, Facebook, Twitter. Uh, you can have multiple IMs at the same time. So let's say if you have, uh, um, let's say you have MSN and you want aim open you can do that it's, it's kind of like Mebo, but it's a it's a direct download right to your PC and um, it's a quick download it's not a big file uh, so don't worry about that so we're gonna bring up Firefox and I'm gonna show you where you can download it and we're just gonna go to digsby.com and yeah um, so anyway uh, it is uh, for uh, Windows. I don't think it's compatible with OS 10, so you're out of luck if you're running OS 10. Um, but anyway, as you see here, it is IM, it's email, and it's social networking. Uh, so it's um, it's a good thing. You can have all these open at the same time. You can check out some screenshots if you want. And um, in order to download, you just go to free download, and uh, you're done. You just you just go through the simple um, process of just downloading it. Um, so then you're left with this. Now I already have a Digsby username and I have my password set. And uh, if you don't have one, just click on "Don't Have an Account" and you can read. It'll automatically redirect you to the site. And uh, by the way, I'll put this in the video description and I'll put Digsby.com in the video description too. Um, so it's a simple registration. Um, shouldn't take any more than five ten minutes. And uh, once you're done with that, you just um, click sign. Alright, there we go. Connecting. I did this with me in my last video too. So for some reason when I record it won't connect. So if I maybe bring it back up. Make sure it's ended. Okay. Alright. Give it a fresh start. And hopefully it will automatically just sign in. Alright, there you go. Um, so, as you see, I've already edited my... Ha I've uh, added all my um, contacts. Um, I did um, my Facebook and my MySpace. Uh, now, um, you can do a lot of things with this. You can customize it in so many different ways. You can make it always on top. So if you have a full window open, let's say like Firefox, I don't see why you you would do this because um, it would uh, it would it would probably mess around with it right now. Um, I just said always on top, but it's not gonna work right now because I have it set on a specific setting where if I have um, this open it's gonna be right next to it and not completely overlaid over it so that's a good thing to have you can get different skins um, so you can you know give it your liking and your own personal preference and while we're here we'll just look at whatever it's easy to add an account just go to add I am account and then you click on whatever you have same thing with email I don't have any set up right now I just use Gmail um, but yeah social networks that's the same um, general and profile you know you can change your uh, buddy icon if you click on promote Di uh, Digsby it will say in your aim in your um, little status thing it will say uh, I use Digsby and uh, you can also tick it so that if um, you tick it it will say launch Digsby when this computer starts so that's a good thing to have um, and yeah there's so much there's just so much stuff to do with this it's completely customizable you can have it so that it logs your um, your conversations just in case you know you want to go back or you know you want to check history on a conversation or something. Um, so that's good. Text format, uh, just like AIM, you know, you can make your default um, font or format uh, however you like it. Uh, status, you can also um, make your own custom status message. You just right click and uh, set I am status to, you know, hold on or away. Um, I made hold on, so if I click on hold on, it'll say that I'm away. So, let's go back to available. And, um, yeah, privacy, you know, you can change sounds. Uh, by default, some pop ups will come up, and I found it kind of annoying, but, you know, you can't do much about it. Widgets, I haven't really tried this out, I don't really know what it is, um, but you can check that out if you feel like it. Yeah, it's nothing that really see me using. Um, you can do, you can follow them on Twitter. You know, if you want to support them, 
Uh, go for it. Um, but I'm gonna just gonna change my skin back. All right, there you go. All right, so that's basically um, a pretty good. Um, I think I covered everything. That's pretty good. A, a pretty good overview so far. So. Uh, anyways, anyway, guys. So, um, I hope you liked my video. I am making new videos. I have new recording dimensions. Um, you can thank Duncan or Mobile Phone 2003 for that one. Uh, check out his video if you want to know the dim uh, dimensions, or check out his blog or whatever. But yeah. So that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll be making more videos in the future. So, peace.